because you've sat in on a lot of producer sessions, you know, what are a couple of things that really make the actor stand out that you end up hiring? I think that first off, uh, as I always tell actors, be you, be organically you, and find something within the material itself that will show you to the producers who are watching you. Uh, that's the best you can do, always. Especially for actresses. Um, a lot of you all who are in your late, late 20s and even into your 30s are still thinking, oh, I shouldn't play an actress, I shouldn't play a mom because moms are old. Well, they're not. <laughs> not in this day and age, not on television, not certainly in kids' TV. They're not. A lot not. of attractive moms do. That's damn right. So what you <laughs> want, sorry, darn right. What you want is to keep all those avenues open. If you're not ready to play a mom yet, in, forget real life, but in television, then don't. But if it's something you want to do, pursue it because there are avenues and, and they're not worth closing. What occupation is being an actor better than? Oh, a bank teller. We've learned that. That's what I did for a little bit. Oh, trust me, a lot better. And I can give you all sorts of ones that it's better than. And why is it better than being a bank teller? Because uh, most of the time you don't have, uh, you're not worrying about somebody putting a gun in your face. <laughs> or not a real one. At a least. real one. That's, just, that's right. A simple piece of advice. Don't let things get you down. It's too easy to hear the negative side. We know the rejection is there. We know that that's what this business is all about. Look at the positives and work and between drive and passion and talent and luck, it may just work for you. Get out, network, it's not a bad word. Mm -hmm. As a matter of fact, it's, a, it's really important. If you love it and you're passionate about it, don't stop.